Good morning guys, how are you doing? Are we completely crashed that after dinner yesterday? Um, quite possibly one of the spiciest dinners I've had in a long, long time. It was hot, hot curry. Hello there. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride it where I like. Say black, I say white, I say bar, I say bite, I say shark, I say him and George was never my scene and I don't like. Well, we're finally here at this Lonely Planet restaurant, Klangsoy. Um, we survived our motorbike ride, didn't we, Ant? Yeah. Made a bit of hash out of that. Couldn't really do it well. While filming, went for one country style curry, chicken, but just country style, don't know what it is, and then one beef green curry. And then we got some chilies in here. Um, let's see how this goes. This is one of the spiciest um, items of food I've eaten in a long time. We're going all in after we finished. Yeah. That green one was one of the hottest things I've eaten in a long time. We didn't even go near near these. Anyway, today is going to be a far more packed day than yesterday. We are heading and doing a bit of sightseeing. We're going to um, Wat Po. We're also going to um, the Grand Te Grand Palace. I want to say that, and then we're going um, to um, the river and doing some riverboat stuff. Good morning, Antonio. How did you sleep? Very well. How are you doing, YouTube? Got a little boat, taxi. On it. Safety first. Life jacket it up. Their version of wheats. Come to the first temple of the day, um, Wat Po, um, or as I was saying earlier, Wat Pho. Um, we just need to get our tickets and then we're allowed into the temple. Still standing still. Now at the reclining Buddha, which is this humongous 46 meter long, and I think I can't remember how tall. I think 12 or 13 meters tall Buddha, but it's huge. It's his face over there, and the Buddha spans all the way across, all the way down. With your ticket on entry to the museum. Museum? It's not a museum. Um, you get a nice little free bottle of water to keep yourself hydrated. Keep yourself hydrated, Anthony. Rip. Can't take out the drone. No. Shame. 
we're now heading to our next temple. Um, we've gone from Wapo, now we're going to um, Wataran, or the Grand Palace, as it's better known. Lots of templates today. They've got this grid system going on with metal railings to shepherd everyone to the entrance which is only just there but we've got to walk all the way through this park first Just come into this memorial centre for a little explore after dropping my camera, I've scraped my lens completely and the main thing we were saying is how peaceful and quiet it is compared to the hubbub and rush around the Grand Palace outside and air conditioning as well Okay, go. So we're currently on our way to um, Bang Lumpu, Bang Lum Lampu, Lumpu, not sure how to say it, um, markets, and it's also where there are a ton of good places to go drinking and eating, according to our guidebook. Um, so that's where we're headed now. This is the infamous Kosan Road. This is Kosan Road. Which is meant to be a hub of debauchery and, and naughtiness. We stopped off for some planage um, with the book to look where we want to head off to to eat later on and to go to the markets with a nice cold beer. Hey buddy, what up? Hungry and tired. Doing a bit of market stall, um, marketing around, looking at markets. Found you. Where you been? What is that, Anthony? 100 plus. Explain what 100 plus is to all our viewers. I guess the English or the American equivalent is Lucasade or Gatorade. This, though, has been anything else. Looks yummy, huh? Thank you. Thank you. What's this called, Anthony? It's roti and egg. It's roti and egg. A little sweet treat with some condensed milk on the top. Sugary milk. Yeah. Got mummy kitto. Uh, do you like the Panasonic? All the baby kittos. Do I like the Panasonic? Uh, yes, I do. Because official verdict of the 100 plus lemon and lime, very good, very similar taste to the other 100 plus, the normal one, but it's still quite a good flavour. Come for a little walk now to the park, which is, I say the park, a park. Yeah, it tastes good, doesn't it? <laughs> Quickly, Anthony, quickly. Quickly, Anthony. Get off the boat now. Philip, I told you four in Australia. Can't you take photos of kids? Anyway, going through um, Chinatown markets and a bit of Chinatown, maybe pick up some street food, but a grub before our main meal later on. Um, it's tasty. Like how it's light. Can you watch it's light? His light flickers on and off as he rides because it's the battery stage. <laughs> The more he accelerates, the more his light comes on. That's so funny. Mate, it's a busy old Chinatown, huh? Oh, proper lobster tail. I'm getting a bit sentimental now, because this is where I first came when I came to Bangkok about three years ago. Very, very busy. And it's busier now. Struggling to even cross the roads. Thank you so much, okay? Thank you. We've got um, Sebastian some oolong tea. Quite uh, a lot. As quite a lot of oolong tea. I uh, hope he doesn't go through it too quickly, but he needs to get a grinder as well for when he, unless he crushes it in a pestle and mortar. But um, it's proper. First took took off the journey. I actually don't think I've ever been in one of these in Thailand. Ever. Yeah. No.
recommendation from friends and other colleagues, we come into the Shangri-La Hotel for a beverage by the pool. Got a little flower. There's a... Yeah, you're right on the river. Perfect. There's a sign upstairs pointing down here for a dinner cruise, which I assume is what's going on here with chefs on board, plating up food, loads of chairs, dining table, and then all these guys, guests at the actual hotel, going on a dinner tour. It's not his it? And then she said not to get a taxi or anything back to the school from a bit this time to get the BTS. Right. It's a busy road. So, we so we've just come to this place called Queen of Curry, recommended by a, a colleague of ours, friend of ours, um, with a very appealing set menu. So if you ever by the river in Bangkok, near the Shangri-La Hotel, come to Queen of Curry. Chang bottle, a singer glass. I don't give a damn. Dish number one, we got some spring rolls, Thai red curry, nom nom nom. Panito incantatum. Tasty. Tasty. Very good meal at um, Queen of Curry's. Definitely recommend. Nowhere near as spicy as yesterday, but that's a good thing. Because um, as much as we both do like and enjoy spice, we could actually eat our food without whimpering and crying. Happy meal. Happy meal. Back to the hotel now. She's probably only about five years old. This is something I still get to grips with whenever I come to Bangkok. That you can just buy knuckle dusters and knives on the street. Good morning, Vietnam! Oh no, we're in Bangkok, aren't we? Guys, it's currently 8.47 in the morning. We leave the hotel at 9.30. Um, this has been a really great trip. I hope you enjoyed it. Coming along for the ride. Oh, did I go... Did I say, hey guys, welcome back to YouTube, welcome back to another video at the beginning? No. Your vlogging is... <laughs> As a lot of your close followers uh, know, you know what I'm talking about. Um, that battery just died, speaking of how much of a pro vlogger I am. Um, I just had to go change the battery. Very good trip in Bangkok, we had a good time. Very good. Yeah, As I was saying it. before, before it cut out, I've been here quite a few times now, even before I started working with the company I work for now. And it's a, it's a lot of fun, it's a cool city. As the Thai um, guidebook we have, Lonely Planet book, very good books if you ever want a guidebook to go travelling. And it says, the old Thai saying, same, same, but different. And that's very true, lots of Asian cities, South, Southeast Asian cities are quite similar, like busy, busy. And like the food is quite similar as well, but Bangkok's a bit different. It's a little bit, a little bit different, more going on, would you say? Yeah. Anything else, more to it. anything else to add on to the end? No, just thanks for having me, and uh, thanks to Bangkok. It's been great. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you're not subscribed, click on the subscribe button already. Lots of fun videos um, sporadically coming up on YouTube because I don't have time to edit them all the time. However, keep up with my Instagram. There's also a link in the account below, and that shows where I am. I'm doing lots of Instagram stories on all my trips too. Anyway, see you in the next one.